Hi everyone, my name is Jerry Bartles and I am a Senior Technical Specialist here at Autodesk. I'd like to welcome you to today's presentation where I will be providing a technology review of Autodesk BIM 360 Team, specifically as it relates to how it helps civil infrastructure teams. During this brief presentation, we will focus on several key aspects of the solution. This includes project coordination. Essentially, we would like to improve how our project team members connect, view assets, share content, and review information. This is accomplished using BIM 360 Teams purpose-built tools that help share and manage our project information and electronic documentation. As a result, we are able to leverage the PDF and or DWF documents that we already create even more than before, which can even further reduce our need for creating paper prints. Finally, because the project documentation is centrally located, it can be accessed anytime, anywhere, and by any authorized project team member, even on a mobile device when that team member is out in the field. Now the way we will focus on these key areas will be through a brief demonstration followed by a summary. We will also leave some time at the end for Q&A. My goals for today's session? First, I would like to give you some exposure to the BIM 360 team solution, as well as review a subset of its capabilities. I say subset because it would take much longer than our conversation today to review all of its functionality. Instead, we will concentrate on the primary features and their related business benefits. In other words, how specifically does BIM 360 Team help address the needs of civil infrastructure customers? And finally, I want to make sure we address any questions you have about our solution. So with that, let's go ahead and get started. We begin our demonstration with the following scenario. We are a project manager responsible for a civil infrastructure project that includes several project team members, both internal and external to our organization. For example, a surveyor, an environmental engineer, structural engineer, landscape architect, contractor, city engineer, and more. To ensure a smooth project, we need to make sure that everyone remains on the same page, which is going to require organization and various levels of communication, as well as efficient decision making and maybe even an audit trail. Now if we pause for a minute, I'm going to ask you to think about what this process looks like for you today. Essentially, how do you keep all internal and external project stakeholders up to speed and communicating effectively? And as you think about that, let me show you how we can accomplish this objective using Autodesk BIM 360 Team. As we begin, keep in the back of your mind that BIM 360 Team is a coordination tool, and the easiest way to visualize this is to think of it as a virtual meeting area dedicated specifically to your project that's accessible to your project team members anytime, day or night. Now let's drill down and take a closer look at the features that it has available to us. The first is access to project-specific wikis. Using wikis, project information in the form of contacts, addresses, phone numbers, meeting notes, project description, and more is available to all project team members day or night from one convenient location. Now think about this for a minute because I'm sure we've all been guilty of this at one point or another. Have you ever gotten an email from a team member that contained a list of contacts or other specific project information? I know I sure have. What happens when you need this information three weeks from now and you're not sure exactly where the email is? Right, you call the person who sent you the email and say, hey, who's the contact at the environmental engineering firm for this project again? I used to work with a guy who would routinely say things like, if one more person calls me and asks me for the contact names again, I'm going to scream. Using the wikis, all of that wasted time can be avoided, not to mention ensure that any updated information is immediately available to all team members, day or night. Next, we have a project-specific calendar. Now, I'm sure if you're like most folks, you manage your calendar using something like Microsoft Outlook and may wonder why this calendar would help. Well, the calendar you're using today likely has entries for multiple projects, which can make it difficult to quickly see all relevant dates for this specific project. Additionally, this is your calendar. In other words, it likely does not contain all of the critical meeting dates and milestones for everyone else working on this project. Using the project-specific calendar in BIM 360 Team provides a quick and convenient tool to access and visualize all relevant project dates for you as well as any other project team members. Additionally, this is not intended to replace your everyday calendar, but rather to supplement it. 
And what I mean by this is that any event added to the BIM 360 team calendar can easily be incorporated into your regular day-to-day all-purpose calendar. We then move to accessing our electronic prints of our plan sheets. Now whether these are PDFs or DWFs, and whether there's only a handful of sheets or hundreds, they can be easily accessed anytime from anywhere. This is not only a great way to make project documentation available to your team members at their fingertips, but also greatly reduces the need for paper plans. Simply assign a team member access to the project and the most current set of plan sheets is immediately available to them. Additionally, because the electronic prints were created by the authoring software, they maintain complete visual fidelity with respect to things like pen weights, line types, fonts, colors, and more as the designer intended. This means that whether you're an Autodesk customer, a Bentley customer, use a combination of both, or something completely different, Autodesk BIM 360 Team can be used effectively on your projects in your organization. If you're using an Autodesk solution like Civil 3D and plotting your plan sheets to DWF, you have the added benefit of being able to drill down and access object-specific properties. For example, in this case, this 2D plan sheet does not contain labels on the structures or pipes. But because the content was created using AutoCAD Civil 3D and printed to a DWF, the civil objects can be selected in the plan sheets. From there, properties can be displayed to show things like rims, inverts, sizes, and more. Think of the time that could be saved by having this model information available. It could reduce the need for additional back and forth communication between the engineer and a reviewer. It could answer questions that otherwise might require several phone conversations. It could even yield an important number right now that would typically have to wait until the right person is available tomorrow morning. When reviewing project documentation, comments can be added to collaborate with others. This can help facilitate the decision-making process or even draw awareness to areas of potential concern. At the same time, when these comments are logged against sheets, an audit trail is automatically created to provide a record of the communication. Autodesk BIM 360 Team also supports the use of an aggregated data model. I have it listed here as optional, as it's not required to be successful. Having said this, if a project model is available, in this case a .nwd file exported from Navisworks, it can help supplement the electronic documentation. As you can see from the video, if we were reviewing the same area using the 2D plan sheets, the proposed design might not be as clear as when it's viewed in the model. For example, we may have detailed section information through the intersection, but have a question as to what's happening between two of the sections. At the same time, even though we're now using a model, we can still drill down and access object properties as well as post comments the same as we did earlier using the electronic documentation. We also have the ability to conduct a live review meeting with multiple team members using either 2D plan sheets or even a 3D model. Meeting participants can even be remote using their phones or tablet to participate in the meeting. Have you ever gone to a project meeting and one of the key team members wasn't able to be there? or worse yet, arrived at the meeting and everybody had to wait because the documents to be reviewed weren't ready yet? Conducting a live review session can improve everyone's productivity for a number of reasons. Travel time is not required. Multiple people can review documents or an aggregated project model from wherever they are, and everyone will always be looking at the same version of the content. Additionally, written communication can be automatically captured to help provide an audit trail of any decisions that are made. So we've run through several of the features that Autodesk BIM 360 Team offers, as well as touched on in a couple of instances, Anytime, Anywhere Access. Let's drill into that aspect a little bit further. Mobile Access is supported on both the Android and iOS platforms using both tablets and smartphones. Using these devices, project team members can access data, collaborate with team members, or contribute additional content remotely. In this example, the mobile user selected the project they were interested in and then immediately drilled down to access the project documentation, a process that's certainly much easier than what they used to do, which was reaching back and grabbing a rolled up set of plans from behind the seat of their field vehicle. Now in this case, they went to the sheet showing the intersection where they were currently at in the field. 
While visiting the site, they noticed that this area could be of some concern, so they wanted to log a comment right there from in the field. Using the voice-to-text recognition software makes the task of entering the comment an easy one. And in addition to entering the comment, they also decided to create a quick red line to make even clearer the area of their concern. If the team member would like to provide additional detail, and truly because a picture is worth a thousand words, they can leverage the camera on their mobile device to supplement their communication. In short, once entered, the comment, red line, and photograph will be made available for access by the other project team members. And if the remote user has a cellular or Wi-Fi connection, their content will be available immediately. So over the last 10 minutes or so, we've looked at how Autodesk BIM 360 team can be used to help keep all internal and external project stakeholders up to speed and communicating effectively on civil infrastructure projects. And after thinking about your current workflow along the way, you're in a better position to compare and contrast BIM 360 team with your existing process. So to summarize, what does Autodesk BIM 360 team do for a civil infrastructure customer? Well, essentially, it's a software solution that helps civil infrastructure professionals more effectively coordinate with their internal and external project team members. During the demonstration, we reviewed a subset of its capabilities, including the wiki, calendar, hosting project documentation, commenting, collaboration, and more. And while its primary purpose is utilizing 2D electronic documents, PDFs and DWFs, we also saw how an optional 3D aggregated project model could be used to supplement team members' understanding of their project. And as for the business benefits, Autodesk BIM 360 team is easy to use, very intuitive, and extremely powerful. Its numerous features will enable you to improve project coordination, reduce the need for paper prints, and provide your team members anytime, anywhere access to project information.